Hello and welcome back to our channel. Today, we have a special treat for all the Apple fans out there. We're talking about the highly anticipated iPhone 15 Ultra. Before getting started hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe our channel. The release of the iPhone 15 is still around 7 months away. And if the rumors are to be believed, the iPhone 15 Ultra will be the topic of conversation everywhere. The iPhone 15 Ultra is said to contain the best of what Apple has to offer in an iPhone, similar to the Apple Watch Ultra. It'll have a 6.7 inches display that's probably fairly similar to the iPhone 14 Pro Max as an iPhone Pro Max successor, but everything else will be updated. The following are some of the iPhone 15 Ultra rumors we've heard. Design Titanium Body After the release of the Apple Watch Ultra, it's safe to assume that Apple is finally working on an iPhone made of lightweight titanium, which has been believed to be in development for years. It's probable that Apple will only provide it in a single color, similar to the Apple Watch, in order to highlight the distinction. Solid State Volume Power Buttons It is anticipated that the iPhone 15 Pro models would have solid state volume and power buttons that resemble the home button on the iPhone 7 and the Force Touch trackpad on MacBooks. The solid state button would use haptic feedback to simulate the feel of a button press rather than the mechanical button that iPhones currently employ. The iPhone 15 Pro variants might include two more taptic engines on the left and right sides of the smartphone if Apple decides to include solid state buttons. The present Taptic engine would be joined by the two new Taptic engines. The volume and power buttons would likely need to be physically accessible at all times in order for a solid-state architecture to provide water ingress protection. Wi-Fi 6E Wi-Fi 6E is a feature that will only be available on the iPhone 15 Pro variants, according to leaked Wi-Fi chip diagrams for the iPhone 15. Wi-Fi 6E will be available on the iPhone 15 Pro and iPhone 15 Pro Max, although Wi-Fi 6 will still be supported on the regular iPhone 15 models. Wi-Fi 6E offers more bandwidth than Wi-Fi 6, resulting in quicker connectivity rates, reduced latency, and improved capacity. In addition to supporting multi-gigabit connectivity for venues and whole home gigabit coverage, Wi-Fi 6E offers 1.2 GHz extra spectrum in the 6 GHz band and has the bandwidth for greater data streams like those utilized for R and VR application. Periscope Zoom There have been numerous speculations regarding Apple's development of Periscope telephoto lenses, and it's possible that these lenses will be included in the iPhone 15 Pro versions in 2023. Ming Kai Kuo, an Apple analyst, claims that the Periscope camera lens will only be available on the larger iPhone 15 Pro Max. The optical zoom capabilities of Periscope lenses are greater than those attainable with normal telephoto lenses, enabling 5x or even 10x optical zoom. The iPhone's zoom capabilities would be greatly improved with a Periscope lens as the current Pro models are only capable of 3x zoom. With a periscope lens, light is reflected by an angled mirror towards the direction of the camera's image sensor. By using a folded telephoto lens system, the directional shift enables better optical zoom capabilities without the blurring that occurs with digital zoom. Camera Sensors For the iPhone 15 models, Apple is anticipated to use Sony's most recent state-of-the-art image sensors. Sony's image sensor doubles the saturation signal in each pixel when compared to ordinary sensors, enabling it to capture more light and reduce underexposure and overexposure. Even when intense illumination is a problem, the sensor will enable improvements in portraits and other photographs. In order to accommodate additional photodiodes, Sony uses semiconductor architecture that separates photodiodes and transistors into different layers. It is unclear if the new sensor technology will be used by all iPhone 15 models or if Apple will reserve it for the more expensive Pro models only. According to unverified Weibo speculations, the iPhone 15 Pro models may cost more, increasing the price difference between the iPhone 15 Pro and Pro Max and the iPhone 15 Plus. Pricing since the starting prices of the iPhone 14 Pro and Pro Max are currently $999 and $1099 respectively, a higher price would indicate that, if the rumor is true, the iPhone 15 Pro's starting price may be above $1000. That's a long list of features that will make the iPhone 15 Ultra the most desirable phone of all time. The iPhone 15 models will likely be released in September 2023 if Apple follows its traditional September launch timeline. So, there you have it. I hope you enjoyed this video. And don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more awesome content. Thank you for watching.